Hey everyone, here's a question from exercise 10.1. First question, this is algebraic expression of class 7. The question is, get the algebraic expression in the following cases using a variable constants and arithmetic operation. So normally what are variables? Variables have a, like they have a different value and they are mostly represented by uh, different letters like A, B, C or X, Y, uh, Z or L, M and like that. Letters which are like in smaller case. And what are constants? Constants have a fixed value, they're normally a number and arithmetic operations is nothing but uh, the addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. So we have to find the algebraic expression which is actually a combination of all these three things. So the first question is subtraction of z from y. So we have to subtract, that is we have to remove z from y. So from y we have to remove z. So the answer will be y minus z. It's not z minus y, it is y minus z. So the first one is that's y minus z. So y and z are like here var uh, variables and uh, minus so is a subtraction. The next one, second question. So in second one we have given one half. One half is nothing but half half of the sum of number x and y. So sum means we have to do addition, addition of x and y. So half of, of means multiplication. So let me write down half here. Half means 1 by 2. Half of, of means multiplication of what? Of sum of number x and y. Sum means addition. So we have to add here x and y. So x plus y. Or in general you can write this as 1 by 2 multiplied by x plus y. Then the next question, the number z multiplied by itself. So you're multiplying z by itself, which means it's z multiplied by z, which is equal to z square. The next one, fourth one, one fourth of product of number p and q. One fourth means one by four. 1 by 4 of product. Product means multiplication. So it's 1 by 4 of means multiplication. Product means multiply. We have to multiply here P and Q. Numbers P and Q they have given. So if 1 by 4 into it's P into Q. So P into Q is nothing but PQ. So here this will be equal to 1 by 4. I'm removing multiplication sign. It's 1 by 4 into P by Q. So there's a no sign here means it's a multiplication. The next one, fifth one. So they have given here number X and Y both squared and added. First we are squaring both the numbers. After squaring we have to add them. Squaring means it's like uh, X square and Y square. You are multiplying the number with itself. So here the numbers are X and Y. So it is X square and Y square. You have squared them. Now you add them. Add means you put plus sign. Then the next one, sixth question. Number 5 added to 3 times the product of M and N. So here you are adding 5 to what? 3 times of product M and N. So product means multiplication. So you are multiplying M and N. So 3 times means 3 into times means multiplication. So it is 3 into the product of mn is m into n is mn. So 3 into mn. To this you are adding 5. So it is 3 into mn plus 5. Or you can write this as 3mn plus 5. The next one. Seventh one. Product of number y and z subtracted from 10. So here from 10 you are subtracting means you're removing the product of y and z so product means multiplication you're multiplying y and z when you multiply y and z it will be y z so y z you're subtracting from 10 so it is 10 from here you're removing y and z so it's 10 minus a y z then the next question this is the last one sum of number a and b subtracted from their product so first what you're doing here you're subtracting the sum sum of a and b will be a plus b 
so this a plus b you're subtracting from where from where you're removing this from the product product means you have to multiply them so you have to multiply a into b it's a b so from a b you're subtracting the sum that is a plus b so put this in a bracket a plus b you have to keep this in a bracket so that's it we have done all the 10 uh, all the eight questions i hope this question is clear how to solve in case you have further question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching